Uh, Jalen, I guess first, just start off with your thoughts. Um, it's really hard. Uh, I think we're all gutted. Um, it's one of our best games, I'd say, for racing in general, like as this club, and especially against a quality opponent, one of the best teams in the league. Like we came out on fire. We did what we wanted to do, and um, obviously to let them creep back in, and then in the 90th minute, give away a goal. It's heartbreaking, especially just because, you know, we just did that in L.A. And these are things we got to continue to learn and tighten up on. But um, I think silver lining, the overall performance was very good. And um, there wasn't much difference, you know, in halves other than the, the last 20 minutes, I'd say. And we had a lot of chances and limited theirs. So we just got to continue to grow, but obviously very disappointed. Um was just the quality of play we had, and we didn't get the, the three points that we wanted on the year. For the second game in a row where individual mistakes really mostly cost the result, how do you deal with that as a team? Because the team, you had a very consistent game. How do you hold players accountable and, and talk about this, especially as the captain? Yeah, I mean, we win as a team and we lose as a team. We tie as a team, everything. Um, so we, we just got to know that, and um, I think – this team is great at taking accountability. And um, I think that, you know, players are going to be able to do that. But I think everybody has a part in a goal. And so that's why it's a team sport. And so we just got to look at film and review. Um, but uh, I, I think this team is really good at looking ourselves in the mirror. And that's what we're going to continue to do and grow from it and learn from it because that's all you can do. Um, we can't hang our heads. We got to we gotta pick each other up after and, and learn. So. So did you say anything to the team, particularly after the match, just kind of tell them to give their heads up? Or what was the message after the match? Um, yeah, I mean, you know, we we're just talking in small groups, and we're just – we're right there. Where That's what we keep saying. And um, we know we're a great team. And I think that's the frustrating – the most frustrating part is – we know how good we are and not getting results um, is tough and we know we should be. And so um, that's, that's next step is, is three points. And that's what we keep saying every game and we're closer and closer. And I know we're going to get there. So we got a great group of girls and um, we got a great staff and we're going to get the ball rolling. It's still early in the season um, and we're going to get, you know, three points soon and continue to build on that. Does a result like this fire the team up and feel like we should have had those three points or is, is this still going to be deflating after, you know, a pretty tough road trip? Yeah, I think it's a short, we got to have a short memory. Um, you know, initially, uh, it, it's going to, it's going to sting a little. Um, we're going to be disappointed, but tomorrow's a new day. Uh, sun's going to rise. We got to look at film. We got to adjust things. Uh, we got to see what went wrong um, as a team individually. And uh, like I said, look ourselves in the mirror, but um, you know, we can take a little bit of time to be bummed out, but new day tomorrow, we'll keep grinding. It's a long season. You played a much more consistent second half than you did say against Angel City when you were up 2-0 also. So what did you guys talk about at the half to come out strongly in the second half? Yeah, we just said we can't come out scared. We can't come out afraid to lose. We have to be on our front foot. Um, and I, I feel like for the most part, that's what we did. And we limited their chances. Um, and now it's just, again, finishing games out. And um, the more this team grows, you know, the, the more I think you're going to see that. And I'm proud of how much we already have grown. Just the difference of last season to this season in each game, you're seeing improvement. And I think that's that's what you can ask for. And like I said, it's a, it's a very long season. And we know we need to get those three points. But we also know it's coming. And we know we have a great group. And um, we, we know it's going to be there. Do you feel that this is a better team than last year's team? Yeah, I think overall it, it's, you know, very complete team. I think um, adding experience was huge. Abby and Carson back there, they're some of the best defender, defenders I've ever played, is, played with. And I think our full back line in general is just great. Katie Lund's light, lights out our midfield, our forwards. I think we're all working so well together. And um, that, that's what you can ask for. And I, it's also just a great group of people. You keep hearing that, but that's how I know we're going to be okay. It's just because uh, I know we have each other's backs. We're great. We're a great group of girls. And uh, that's how I know that at the end of the season, we're going to be okay. Jay, were you surprised that Sav got sent off the first Um, Yeah, I mean, I want to say surprise. I was a little surprised on the foul that I got called initially. Um, but it's part of it. Uh, when things like that happen, uh, when you can't crumble as a team, you got to come together. When you face adversity, uh, that's when your true colors come out. And I think for the most part, 
you know, we did a good job. Um, that's the first time we've been down really uh, a player against, like I said, a quality oil rain team. So I think it was a good test for us. Um, and I think moving forward, we can we can learn a lot just playing a man down. You try, I guess, to emphasize the process is going right now to show that, hey, I'm all positives here, and it's not just all about me. I'm sorry, what was the first part? Uh, are you trying to emphasize the process as opposed to the results right now, even though they're not coming yeah. at this point? Um, yeah, I mean, we know we got to get results. That's not a secret. I mean, we're not going to sugarcoat it. We need three points. We haven't got three points on the year. It's frustrating. It's it's really frustrating. But I think, it, like I said, it's a very long season, and we know that. And just from playing last year, I know that. And um, I, I think that's what's going to keep this group together is is knowing that and knowing that if we continue to build and grow in each game, we get better, then we're going to get the results in the end. And uh, like I said, we got a great group of girls, and our attitudes are great. And that's that's a whole nother side of it is just having the mentality to come back and win and we're gonna do that.